hello everyone today i am here with a new video in which i will repair the damaged wire of the lenovo laptop charger wire damage is a common issue which everyone face at least once in a lifetime i have just connected the defective charger to the laptop and to find out whether this is the only issue in this charger or it is having any other issue in it so i am just uh, twisting the damaged part of the wire if the connection will be created it will give you a beep sound as per the uh, feature of this laptop so uh, while it is getting connected uh, it starts charging it means this is the only problem so uh, now we will go ahead and open up this charger most of the time these chargers are sealed and non repairable you can't able to open it normally so uh, i need to open it with any other method so i'm using this knife and a hammer to open it up I am making this process a bit faster. Okay, so I need to solder the fresh end of the wire to this part of the PCB. So I will sniff out the older wire which is connected to this PCB. Okay, it's done. Now I will put it into the uh, first end of the sniffed wire. Okay. I need to pull it out. Okay, it's done. So uh, for this time I am keeping this uh, back. I am sniffing the outer cover at the end of this wire. As you can see uh, the naked wire is for the negative and that uh, white wire is for the positive terminal. So uh, I will just twist it up. So now I will desolder this old uh, part of the wire from the PCB okay it's done and now time to connect the newly sniffed wire you need to be very careful at this point make sure you are soldering each of the negative and the positive terminal of wire uh, on the same place where it belongs to I mean negative wire should soldered with the negative point on PCB and the same with positive wire I mean the white wire okay 
I am just twisting the wire to create a tight connection with the PCB. Generally this doesn't require as we are going to solder these wires. Okay, we are done with this. Now I will uh, solder it out. Okay, it's done. And now I will solder it uh, from the other side of the PCB which will keep the wire strongly bonded with the PCB. Okay. Now time to solder the positive terminal of wire. So I am putting the wire on its preferred place to solder it up. First of all I need to twist it up. Okay. Oh, first of all I need to clean the hole. Uh, as you can see the malt uh, that uh, soldering element is inside the hole I need to clear it up first to insert the wire in it Okay, it's done. So time to solder it up. Okay, it is soldered. So uh, I need to solder it from the other side of the PCB. As you can see, and the wire has been perfectly soldered to the PCB. So uh, now time to fix the chassis of the charger. So I will put all the parts on it place. You need to check all the gaps so that uh, each and every part should fix uh, exactly on their place okay I have broken that LED while opening the case so that doesn't matter that is only the indication uh, for the charger whether it is getting on or uh, whether it is getting current uh, in it or not so that that's not important the thing is that laptop need to be charged from this charger So time to check it. I have just plugged in the charger to the source. Okay. So it is getting charged. 
so here uh, we are getting the laptop indication it starts blinking after some times it will be stable as per the feature of this laptop so we have restored the charger thank you for watching this video see you in the next video